Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Today, we are going to present about LOC-based estimation. LOC stands for Lines of Code. That is, to estimate the software sizing directly. So, there are many methods, but LOC is one of them. So, before doing the estimation of software sizing, we have to consider about the type of project, the application domain, and the functionality delivery. We have to do a bounded statement of scope into problem functions that can each be estimated individually. This productivity matrix is then applied to the appropriate estimations variable. Thus, the greater the degree of partitioning, the more reasonably accurate it is. So in this slide shows the formula of how to calculate LOC and you can see the explanation of each symbol down there. And for and next is the example of how to calculate LOC. The formula is uh, first calculate the actual number of use cases multiplied by LOC average. Then calculate the division of actual scenarios and average scenarios minus 1. And then plus the division of actual pages and average pages minus 1. And multiply with LOC adjust. Then add the first one and the second one together to get the LOC estimation. The advantage of LOC is simple to measure. And there are five drawbacks of LOC. The first is it is defined on code. For example, it cannot measure the size of specification. And the second one is it characterizes only one specific view of size, namely length. It takes no account of functionality or complexity. And the third one, bad software design may cause excessive lines of codes. Fourth, it is language independent. And the last one is users cannot easily understand it.